guys, first tutorial, here it comes. Here's the look. Really simple, really easy, great for every day. You want to see how you get it? Just keep on watching. So I've already applied my primer on this eye here. So the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to take our jumbo pencil in milk and we're going to apply that all over the eyelid. Just put it on at first and then blend it out there. You can use your finger, but it gets kind of messy doing that. So I just got an old brush, like I never use this brush, and I just dedicated this brush to using with my jumbo pencils to blend them out. And just blend them just like that. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my Coastal Sense 88 Shimmer Palette and I'm going to grab this small fluffy angle brush. I love using these brushes, one of my favorite brushes. And I'm going to pick up my, okay, disclaimer, my Coastal Sense palette, like, I use it so much. Like, I use it on a daily basis, and it's, you can so tell, like, don't judge me. Please don't judge me, but this thing is a mess, a mess. like, seriously. But I'm going to show you what colors I'm going to use. I love mixing up colors and making new colors. That's, like, the thing I love to do the most. And so, the color that we are going to put on our outside, like this here, the outside color, I'm going to create by mixing this kind of indigo blue color here on the bottom. I don't know if you can see that. I hope you can. And this color right here, this color right here, I'm sorry, this indigo, this indigo color and that color right there. So I'm blending those two together. I really hope you can see that. If not, I'm going to do better next time. I, I promise. And I'm just going to take that on that, those two colors on that blending brush. So we're just going to take that on the outer corner here. And I like to just draw the shape first before anything else. Just draw the shape. Take it in about maybe half. Just round like that. Round out the edge. And just blend it inwards a little bit. Like that. Just keep going around and blend out the edges a little bit. The next thing we're going to do is we are going to take a flat shader brush, like so, and we're going to mix two more colors together. We're going to mix this color here, this kind of a plummy color here, and we're going to take this pink right here. That pink. We'll see the future holds. And I'm just going to pat, up, pat this on the lid all the way to the inner corner. And kind of blending it. Just back and forth like this is a good way to blend. And the outside. Blend that pink and that plummy color. Next, I'm going to take a bigger fluffy angled brush and I'm just going to blend out the edges. Just kind of windshield wiper motions. A combination of windshield wiper and like circular kind of motions with this and kind of round it out on the outside like that. Just blend out the edges there and Check the status here and see how it's going. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to see if I can find it. We're going to take a small, small, small shader brush. I like using the small shader brushes to do the inner corner highlight. So I'm going to pick up. Whoa, that's way too much. Oh, oh. We're going to pick up the white. In the very top, the shimmery white. 
this one right here. Sorry, I'm lip syncing with the music. <laughs> and we're just gonna pop that right on the inner corner there. Kind of blending it up into the pink a little bit. Add some highlight to our inner corners. Just brighten it up in there. Next, we're going to pick up a large fluffy brush like this one. These are great. Great, great, great for doing the highlight. Large, kind of flat brush. And we're using that white again that we used in the inner corner. This shimmery white from the Coastal Sense palette. And we're just going to highlight all over our brow bone. Like that. I'm kind of blending it out with the purple. Like that. So those are the main colors in the look. The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna line with my liquid liner. I love liquid liner. It's my favorite. And I like to kind of keep my eye open because it helps me monitor the shape of it so that it matches both eyes. And I'm at a really awkward angle, so kind of crazy at any point that's why because I'm like doing this really awkwardly like if you could see how my arms are right now they're like I don't even know thing we're going to do is add our pencil liner in the our black pencil liner. Oh, it's not the camera over. We're just gonna put that on the lash line. Whoa, until I have my mirror in the video. Sorry guys. Tutorial is kind of rough, but it's my first time. And I always run my finger along the bottom of it. Kind of makes it kind of kind of cleans it up, I think, a little bit. Next, to open up my eyes, I'm going to put some more of that jumbo pencil in the waterline. This could be kind of tricky. Yeah. So that's really all there is to the eyes. It's really simple. And now we're just going to do what you do to your face. I'm going to contour with my Maybelline bronzer. What's the shade? Forever Warm. I'm just going to take the bronzer. I'm going to contour my cheekbones just a little bit. What I'm using is a Mary Kay color, actually. Sparkling Cider. It's the blush I pretty much use every day. I want to get NARS work as I'm really bad. Pop that on the cheekbone. And this is just a basic look. So, on a normal day to day basis, this is just a normal, pretty much day to day look. I just use a little bit of the bomb. So that was my first tutorial. Let me know what you think. Um, yeah. It was a rough run, I know. It'll get better, I promise. Just keep watching, guys. I promise it'll get better. Um, yeah, there's pretty much more where that came from. Just stay tuned and keep watching, guys.